For the Circuit Python Parsec today, I wanted to show you how to use a carriage return instead of a new line when you are printing to the serial output. So here's an example of a free floating analog pin that I'm reading. But that's hard to read because we have these characters flying up the screen. And the reason for this is that the default in the print is to end with a new line, which means it goes to the beginning and adds a new line for every print statement. If we change this instead to a carriage return or a return, what happens is it goes to the beginning after each print statement, but it does not add a new line return. Instead, is just this carriage return. Uh, and so you can see here the way to do this is if I take a normal print statement and add to the end of it this here, comma, end equals, and then in quotes, backslash r, and that's the return or carriage return. The default, if I don't have that in there at all, or if I change that to n, looks like this. And so we get this sort of string of uh, characters flying by, or a string of lines flying by. Uh, this instead is a lot more helpful for measuring values and seeing them without getting endless scrolling of your text. And so that is how you can use a return instead of a new line when you're printing to serial output inside of CircuitPython. And that's your CircuitPython Parsec.